it's good to see you. We are getting ready to leave to go up to Virginia to my dad's to get the little cat that needs a home. We're going to bring her here. And I thought the best thing I could do would be to set her up for now in um, my bathroom area. There's no carpet in here. I don't know if she's litter box, if she uses a litter box or not. I think she was an indoor cat, but I don't know. I'll show you what I have put in here for her. Evie has been here checking it out. It's like, I don't know. I have the little cat bed there. I got this scratching post for her. I think it's a she. I'm not entirely sure. What do you think of that, Evie? What do you think? I don't give a crap. I got some little toys, a bottle, of, a bowl of water, a bowl of food. I have a fresh litter box here for her. I closed my closet door because there's carpet in there and lots of stuff. And I, I just, I want to keep her out of there. So she'll have this entire area to stay in. And then I have, I have these double doors right here. So there's actually a little space here and here where Evie and Pumpkin will be on the other side and she'll be in here. And they can sniff at one another and play footsie under the door and um, start to get used to one another that way. And there's a little area in here too. She, so she'll have access to this whole area here. So, and Evie, you're going to have to get out. I'm not going anywhere. What do you think? Yeah, she knows, she knows something's up. She, she's been acting kind of weird. <laughs> so anyway... We're gonna go get the cat, and we'll see what happens. You're the only following <laughs> me. Here we have the you kitty. Where's where'd you go? Hey there. I know. Yes, yeah, yeah, so I know. Here. Come here. I think. I'm trying to get him to come over here. I think it's actually a boy. Yes, I think you're a boy. I do. Whoops! What was that? What was that noise? It's okay. Oh, very happy. Very happy. Yes. Yes. Where are you going? I have the uh, the cat carrier over there, and um, we're going to get him loaded up. Yes, we are. Ain't you something? Yes, you are. What are you doing? <laughs> I just figured it would be better to get down here on the floor. Yes. Very nice. You going to talk to me? Give me, give me. Don't stop petting me. Don't stop petting me. Yes. Where... Look. Pet me, pet me. <laughs> uh huh. All right. What do you say we load up the kitty and go home? Yeah. Should we do that? <laughs> no. I don't care. It'll be fine. Look at that long tail. The tail looks like there's a there's a wounded there's a hurt place on the tail down near the base. I'm gonna have to get that checked out for sure, but. Um, I believe it's a he. He'll be going to the vet pretty soon. And uh, yeah, he's a little overstimulated. <laughs> we'll be taking him to the vet and getting him checked out and see what. Ouch! See what he needs. Okay, buddy. Let's take you home. You want to go home? Yes. I'm going to make that long drive home now. All right. Well, I'm back sitting on the floor, but I'm sitting on the floor at home. Yes, I believe this is a boy. And he did great. All the way home, he slept most of the way. We had him in the little cat carrier. He went right in. I put a little food in there, and he went right in. He complained a little bit at first, but then he just went to sleep. Yeah. Yes. Hey, it's okay. He gets a little overstimulated and then he gets a little bitey. We're going to work with him on that. Yeah. Uh, Evie and Pumpkin don't know what to think. They, um, they were at the door over there <laughs> hissing and, uh, they were over at the door and not, not too happy about it. <laughs> They said no. So, um, yeah, it's going to take a little time to get used to him, but he is very happy. 
So, yeah. So far. Are you happy? Are you happy? Look, got you a scratch and post. Yeah. He already got in his little bed. I have a little, a little bed for him over here. He's already laid down in that for a little bit. So, yes. I'm happy. You okay? Yeah. So, he's going to live in here for a little while. I just want to keep them separate, but, um, they can sniff one another under the door and in the cracks between the doors. Yep. He's climbing me. <laughs> oh, okay. Yeah. I'm going to give him a few days to get used to it. I'm going to go ahead and call the vet and see if I can get an appointment, get him an appointment. Um, yeah, I'll get you checked out and see what's going on with you. So, yeah. Ah, oh, okay. I just thought I'd come in here and sit with him for a little bit. Yes. He's all right. He's a good boy. I don't know what we're going to name him. I like to keep my cats around, you know, just see what name seems to fit him. I don't know yet. But we'll see. We'll see what name fits. I want to get to know him, know his personality a little better. So... Anyway, here he is. He's very nice. He's very happy. Yeah. And this is probably what I'm going to do for the rest of the night. So, <laughs> hey, yes. And I will see you later. Can you say bye? Well, you can lay down next to your bed. Can you say bye? Close enough. <laughs> bye bye.